After starting the season an even three for three, the Lord's lacrosse team looks to head into the heart of NCAC play and claim a conference title, especially after getting a big opening win against DePaul. We're joined today on the Keaton Sports Connection by Lord's sophomore attacker, Emilio Sosa. And Emilio, you know, he started the season one and three and two of those losses against Albion and Aurora, really tough losses. What was the message coming from the coaching staff after that? Well, the message was just keep pushing forward. And our goal from the beginning of the season has always been to win a conference title. And that's what we're going for. So we have to beat teams like Ohio Wesleyan and Denison to do that. And we're really focused on those games going forward. And we're not trying to look back in the past. Those were hard fought games, but we couldn't finish them. But, you know, we have to move on. Go ahead. Oh, so after that then, you guys played DePaul at home to open the NCAC season, get a big win, and then on Wednesday you beat Otterbein 12-11 to in a really tight game. How, what kind of confidence are you taking from those? We're, we're, getting, we're taking a lot of momentum from those games and hopefully you know, riding that wave to hopefully beating an Ohio Wesleyan uh, team tomorrow and um, working off of those games. We had a lot of good things come out of those games. A lot of, you know, we won, we uh, came through in the fourth very uh, strong against DePaul and in the fourth against Otterbein, and that's, those are some things we have to take um, for the whole game against teams like Ohio Wesleyan. All right, so you, know, you mentioned the Ohio Wesleyan game. We'll get to that in a minute. But first off, you personally are having a great season. You've got 17 goals, three assists. It means you're first in goals and second in points on the team. You know, obviously an increase in minutes coming from your freshman to sophomore year, but what is kind of opening up out there for you? Well, I think that just the way that our offenses are set up, um, you know, I'm getting open for the middies, and you know, they're, they're working towards us, you know, dodging really hard. And, I'm just open backside, just trying to you know help them out because you know they're so they're so winded from you know having to play defense as well. And you know me and Robert and uh, Ian and Josh are just trying to work and help them out as much as possible and do our job and put as many points up as possible. Uh, you mentioned Robert Jacobs, and you know as a senior leader, he's kind of switched from more of a goal scorer to a passer. How big is it to have him kind of operating behind the net there and getting you the ball? Well, it's awesome. You know, he's really stepped into a role as a, as a feeder and. You know he's really worn that role very well, and he's you know he's got whatever 13 points and uh, or 13 assists this year, and you know he's really stepped up, and he's still scoring a lot, and you know he's doing everything that we he, we need for him uh, we need him to do for us. All right, so now you mentioned Ohio Wesleyan coming up tomorrow on Saturday. It's Senior Day, a lot of uh, emotions going to that as well as the Saturday home game. What do you guys need to do to get that victory? We need to play a full 60 minutes of lacrosse. You know we've seen sparks of you know high level lacrosse, you know, beating teams like that, but we just have to have a full 60 minutes. And, you know, if we can do that, I really believe we can win this game. So you had to play Ohio Wesleyan and uh, Denison both on the road last year. Now you get to play them both here at McBride. How big is that? That's huge. You know, we love playing here. You know, we, we have a pretty good record here my, la my last two years, and it'll really be helpful to have, you know, a, as many fans out as possible. I know there's a lot of alums coming back, so I think it's going to be a good atmosphere. and I, Hopefully we can get the win for everyone. All right, well, the game tomorrow starts at 1 p.m. against Ohio Wesleyan. We'll have it for you live streaming at athletics.kenyon.edu. For Emilio, I'm Matthew Ruskin. Thank you for joining us.